Hi, I'm Jill. And I'm Monica. And we're ecologists with the Australian Wildlife Conservancy. Today, we're at Yukamara in the Mallee. AWC is currently conducting conservation actions across more than 12 million hectares in Australia. This includes sanctuaries where the numbat resides, like Yukamara. These actions include things like weed control, fire management, and feral predator and feral herbivore control. Numbats are super unique Australian mammals. That's because unlike other Australian mammals, numbats are diurnal. This means they come out during the day. Numbats are special to me because their stripes are like a unique identifiers to each individual, just like a fingerprint. And we can use this using our camera traps to monitor where they're going throughout the sanctuary. Something you probably don't know about numbats is that they're specialised eaters. They have a specialised diet, which is exclusively termites. They eat around 20,000 termites every day. Numbats are currently endangered with roughly 1,000 left in the wild. And this is due to things like cats and foxes and habitat loss. Numbat populations are doing a lot better inside fenced exclosure areas where cats and foxes are excluded. In these areas, the numbat populations are increasing. One other thing we do to protect numbats is we build fences like these. This is an exclusion fence. It keeps out the feral foxes and cats and herbivores such as goats and rabbits. There are cool features in this fence. One of them is the small wire down the bottom of the fence. So this stops rabbits and baby rabbits from getting inside. We also have the floppy top. The floppy top makes, makes it so that if cats are trying to climb in, when they get to the top, they fall off and they can't get in. We also have electric wire as well. With all these strategies on this fence, we make sure that there are no feral animals inside. And that means we can reintroduce species such as the numbat to live in this protected area. There are a number of great initiatives to help support the numbat, but one way people like you can get involved is by supporting the collaboration between Australian Geographic and the Australian Wildlife Conservancy.